So this is a quick uh, tutorial on how to adjust the temp on a Nurture Right 360 incubator. You cannot just go off of what the top is showing here on the incubator. It is often not accurate. I have a Govy thermometer. I got this off of Amazon. And let me see if you can get So it's showing here, it's only 98 in the incubator. Whereas up here, it's showing 99 and a half on temp. So what I'm gonna do is just adjust, go ahead and adjust the temp on here to be warmer. And what you want to do is keep your incubator, I like to keep mine right around 100. Definitely 98 is not gonna work. You'll look up and your chicks will hatch late or not at all. Um, that's just not quite warm enough. So what you're gonna go ahead and do here is hold down the menu button here. The menu, okay, hold it down for about three seconds. Then you're going to just hit this. I'm gonna bump it to right there. And it will set. And then I will come back here in, I'll usually give it three to four hours or so. I will come back and check it again, see if my temp is where I want it to be. Um, if for some reason then it's running ever running too hot, you can do the same thing. Hold that down until it does the long beat and then just push the uh, minus button and it will go down. Also, the and every single nurture right I've had, the humidity shows higher here than what it actually is in the incubator. Um, like right now, this one's at 36, 37. Um, I keep mine just right around there, um, upper 30s to 40, and you only need to add a little water to, and it will, it will climb up. If for some reason your humidity gets too high, I always come in here, I just open that vent. That usually brings the humidity down. You do not want it to get too high until about three days before they hatch, you'll bump it bump the humidity up up until that point you will drown the chicks if you get it much higher in my experience um, so I usually keep it right around 100 degrees and about 38 there I'm happy with that on the humidity so there you have it